Well, it's Saturday morning and uh, sun is shining. So I'm gonna go over and see my old mate, Richard Hutley, also known as uh, the Lazy Baker, because it's breakfast time and I'm in dire need of some fodder. Hello. Apart from Richard, he looks like another suspect of mine. Oh my God, it's trouble. Mr. Tatner. What are you doing, man? How are you? I'm all right. How are you? <laughs> Good to see you, What's going on? What are you doing today? I don't know. Nothing, man. I'll come man, over for mate, some breakfast mate, to mate, see mate. this man, Mr. Hartley, for some breakfast. Good morning. Listen, I've yeah. just had Sh uh, Shane from uh, Rye Bay Fish on the phone. Yeah. There's some banging clams. He's just given me a call. And there's nothing better than banging clams. <laughs> banging clams, yeah. <laughs> so what we're going to do yeah. is we're going to go and pick some up. And do you fancy jumping in the bus with me and we'll just go and do a bit of cooking? Well, this little baby. Yep, yeah, we've got the bus. We've got the fire stove in the back. I've got some amazing pancetta from Jamie Wickens. Let's go and cook it up somewhere. Rich, how yeah, does that sound? It sounds awesome. You better have some bread for that. We are going to need some bread. Come on in. Come on Let's in. get some bread. Let's get stuck get in. Come on in. <laughs> oh, look. Lazy Baker. What you want with that is some lovely sourdough baguettes. I will pop up the chip. Look at this, Rich. Look, look at this. Lovely. A plethora. Would you say you had a plethora? I, I would say I have a cornucopia myself. <laughs> oh, yeah. Man. So Rich, for people who are watching, well, what, now, um, what have we got here? So what's the setup here? Do you do this every day or do you just do it like, uh, on Saturday mornings or what? You, you, pick, you pick a boozer in rye, I'll sell bread in it. So, <laughs> so every Saturday in here, when, every Wednesday in Old World Wines, uh, you can pick up in various places around town. So what a fantastic find me the secret. So we've got nice. little, all sorts, we've got sourdoughs here. So these are the babies that we're going to have. Well, these are the what babies you're going to have here, some sourdough baguettes there. But we also have things like some raisin and walnut sours there. Oh my god. A little focaccina. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, well. <laughs> Look at this, man. Lazy focaccina. Well, I don't know about you boys. I'll get a bit hungry. And I'll, yeah. I'll need a coffee as well. Let's grab a coffee, then let's go and see Shane. And let's get this bread dipped in some beautiful sauce. We're going to make some clams with some pancetta, sage, this cream. Will soak up your juices beautifully. Oh, there you go. Nice one, Boys. Rich. Enjoy. Enjoy. See you later. See, See you in later, a while. Mate. Right. So we've just arrived down here at uh, Rye Bay Fish. Where, um, what are we buying, Carl? We're going to go and get some clams off Shane. Let's, let's go and get on, some let's, clams. Let's get in here. Where's the boss? Shane. How you doing, mate? All right, how are you? Right. How are you doing, Ease? Hey, get this jacket right. on. I'll Come on, let's on. get ready, mate. <laughs> look at all this, Graham. Get a bit of this in. Look at look that. At this. Yeah. Now, this is why we live down here, mate. Because, look at that. Look at that turn of bot. Monkfish. Look at this. We've got a bit of sushi tuna, the famous rye based scallops. And what we've got for down here, rye based scallops. Look at that. Epic. Look at this stuff. Now that's what it's about. Shane, how you doing, fella? How are you, alright? Good to see you, man. Hey, mate. All right, you alright? So, uh, so, Carl's down there, we're doing a bit of cooking today. Right. Uh, these clams you tell me about, yeah, let's so have a look at them. Over here. Oh my lord, look at these. Beautiful, these are. Look at them. Uh, where are they coming from, Shane? These, are, these are come from Scotland. Oh, nice. They're all nice. flat with meat, they're beautiful. Right, we'll have a couple of kilos of that then, mate, yep, please. Okay. We're going to cook them up with some pancetta and wine and cream sauce. So, Shane, you working every day of the week? Um, I'm working at five days at the moment. Five days five a week? Five days, yeah, one day off. We so, what, 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 what days are you open? What do you mean you have a day off? I've got to try and get a day off. <laughs> I'll tell you what I've seen as well. Look at this, chaps. A bit of sand fire. Is that from around here? No, that, that's, that's, that comes from France. Oh, no, man, no. <laughs> yeah, that's such a nice Look at this, though. Look, local place. Those are beautiful. beautiful. These look are look lovely, look. Look at these. Oh, look at that prawn, mate. You see, that's what it's about. This so, is the place Mr. Tanner? Come. Yes, mate. Some clams, what's going in it? Some clams, we've got some smoked pancetta. Yeah. Uh, we've got fresh sage. Yeah. We're gonna go down to Old World Wines and get some 
We're going to get, get some, some good, good white wine. Yeah. Um, and then we're going to cook them up, and then we're just going to put loads of fresh sage in it. Really earthy, meaty stuff going on. It's um, the way forward. It's it the way it forward. Is. It is. It's how to spend a Saturday, boys. That's it. Shane, good to see you, my man. And I'll see you later on. Cheers, mate. Thank you. Cheers, mate. See you later. Thank you. We're uh, we're off to cook these clams. Wait, wait. Yes, man. It's close, mate. It's no one here, mate. It's close. Listen, fella. Oi. Oi, oi, oi. What? What do you oh, think he's got a key to the, of course you've got a key to the wine shop. <laughs> you wino. <laughs> I think you got me in one. <laughs> oh, nice. Let's go and get some wine. Let's go and get some wine. Danny, hope you don't here. mind. But we're we're going to go and help ourselves to some of your delicious wine. Right, Kyle. Okay, we're in, right. man. We're, we're in. in. We're in. We're in. So this is, uh, this is your <laughs> yeah. area of expertise. Okay, okay, okay. Well, my old mate Dan's not here, but I'll tell you what. You see this? Local. <coughs> look, someone's already been at the bloody thing, look. This is the Oxley Organic, right? It's from, from down the road uh, in Beckley. This is beautiful. Dry, crisp. I'll tell you what, mate. Pull that cork out, fella. Never Just put early. a little drop. It's never ever too early. Right, have a little sip of that and see what you think. Get your bugle in there. Now that with the clams, it's got enough of those sort of Kentish fruits in it, but it's dry, crisp. Carl, I think I got a bit too excited there, fella. Bit too, much wine, bit too much wine last night, Graham. Bit shaky hands, was it? Bit shaky, shaky. <laughs> I'll tell you what, mate. No, I think I need the stop, stop button. So this wine, Perfect. Perfect. That goes so well with the clams, it's man. It's lovely and crisp. It's going to work really well with that smoky flavour from that pancetta, the freshness from the cream. Yeah. It's just going to. I'm getting excited, Graham. We, we need to go and cook this stuff. Let's up. go cooking, fella. Come on, mate. Let's go. Oxney, we love you. We're going to drink you. Right. We're here down at the boatyard. We've. Uh, we thought this would be a great venue to do a little bit of. Uh, a little bit of cooking. And here we are. See, look, there's the master at work. <laughs> Mr. Tatner? Yes, mate. This is looking good. There's your little... Nice. That's a little fire going. We've got the fire going. We're just doing the <coughs> chopping the shallots here. This is a really easy dish. We'll break it. Once we've got all this done, we'll just break it down before we start. So you've got some shallots going in. Got some shallots. <coughs> Excuse me, where else are you going to go? We've got garlic. Yeah. Nice garlic. We're not messing about here, Graham. You know, we don't... We don't mess about, so I'm just going to break these off and literally just give them a... Give them a smash. Give them a smash. I'll tell you what, mate, you know that little wine? This one here. Yes, yes, yes. While you're doing that, mate, I might just have a sneaky glass. Yeah, let's get some, let's get some cups out. Right, Carl, we're right. ready to rumble. This is it. Right. What we got? So, for anyone who wants to make this recipe at home, it's so, so simple. It's all about the good ingredients. You've seen where we've got it all from. So, we've got some Richard's bread. That's for later. So, all you're going to need, one shallot, roughly chopped. Yeah. Garlic, roughly chopped. Bunch of sage, roughly chopped. Some wicked clams from Shane at Rye Bay Fish. I've got some of this amazing pancetta. Yeah, it looks really good. I've got this from Jamie Wickens down at Winchelsea Beach. Okay, I've cut it into lardons. There's a bit so you can have a look at. This is the skin. Now we take the skin off because it's hard, but we're going to keep that because we're going to drop that in the sauce because that is full of beautiful smokiness. Absolutely ugh, mm. amazing. So, first things first. Put the bread away. Okay. First of all, we need to get that fat out of the pancetta, all that sweet fat. All right. Okay, and the skin. Throw the skin in there. Okay, we're cooking this on our stove. I like this little stove, mate. Yeah, man, it's cool. This is our <laughs> little frontier fire stove. This is the way forward, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, fantastic. Little folds away. Right, so what I'm doing here, Gray, okay, is I'm just getting this fat out of this out of this pancetta before we go. So we're just going to cook that. Just going to leave that there. Okay, then we're going to add some. See the fat's just starting to come out of it now. All right, so so simple. It's a crowd pleaser as well, Graham. Do you know what I mean? It's all about fresh, Listen, mate, fresh flavours. There's nothing better than pleasing crowd. There's nothing better than pleasing the crowd. Okay. 
Right, next right, bit. Right, Carl, what's the next stage, fella? Right, next bit. Right, have a look in here. Get your camera in there. Great. Right, we started rendering this fat down. Yeah. Okay, we don't want too much colour because the sauce is going to be a white sauce. All right. So the shallots and garlic now. Yeah. They go in. We're just going to give them a good stir up. Let them. Moon, I can smell that. Yeah, mate. So we just want to let them soften again. Not too much colour because it's it's a it's a cream sauce that we're that we're dealing with. We don't want it to be too dark. All right. Yeah. Cool. So we're going to sweat them down. Smelling good, man. Smelling good, mate. Smelling, Smelling good. good. Yeah. Yeah. All right, then, Gray. Okay. So the, uh, the 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 garlic and the shallots they soften. Okay. Now the yeah. star of the show. Come on. All then. right. Now it's the star of the show. Now these beautiful clams. They're gonna go straight in. All right. Spread them out. All right. And there goes the Venus. Okay. Yeah, we don't the want oxenate. too much going in there, mate. Not too much. Them. Not too much. Get in there. All right. We're going to steam them in this wine. Beautiful. All right, that goes in there. And then the lid. The lid called Jane. The lid called Jane. This is a Jane's lid. lid. It's Jane's lid. All right, so you don't have to have Jane written on your lid, but if you do, just, just, just bang it on there. Shove their respect. So now we've got a little bit of time. Yeah. So what we're going to do? Set out on my arbor. Yeah, look at this. Um, there is a little bit of this wine left, Ryan. Do you know what? I think we need, we deserve a beverage. In homage to, to the late, great... Keith Floyd. Mr. Keith Floyd. He was a legend. And it's an inspiration for us doing these little videos on a shitty little phone. On a shitty little phone. But enjoying little... everything about food It's Mr. Keith. We'll Cheers. come back we'll when the back. clams have opened. Right. So, Mr. Turner. Let's have a little look in here, Get great. that lid off. Oh, look. Look how meaty they are, look at them. I he can wasn't... smell it, can you smell it, can you smell he, it? He wasn't lying, Shane, was he? Look. Can you see that, Graham? Oh, look. man, that's hot. Look at that. Right, let's do this quick. All right, so they're starting to open. Yeah. All right, so now the next bit's quite quick. We don't want to overcook these. Come on in, in All you right, go. All right, so, splash of fish stock, yeah? Yeah. All right, not too much. Okay, I've got some lovely local cream from a local dairy. It's just across the border from Kent in a place called Beddington. All right, and then we're going to pour this cream over them. So a bit like a Moore's Marinier, if you like. Really good double cream. I'm going to chuck another one in there. Now, if you're on Weight Watchers... <laughs> What's that? Yeah, this ain't for you. All yeah, right, there's no Weight Watchers do this. points in there. All right, and then generous with the sage. All right, save a little bit for after. Yeah. You want to chuck that on the top, just to make it look pretty. Give it a stir. Okay, now we don't want the lid going on that. We don't want the lid going back on. All right, we want that cream to reduce. And it's just going to intense everything. Look at it, Graham, look at it. Oh my God. You know God. what I like as well, mate? Someone's got kind of wandered in. He's wandered in, and he's... And, he's and this fella, look, look. There's a man. There's a fine figure of a man. This is a man who likes clams. So he's come... He, is, that what it, is that what it is? I, 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 what, and I smell this. Oh, I've got to investigate. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, we're going to do a bit of investigating in a second. Right. What, 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 well, Carl, here we are, mate. Right, here we are, fella. Food's ready to go. Food's ready to go. Get in here now, look. We've got a couple of people that have come to join us. So I've right. just, just got to say, yeah. on their boats. Don't overcook. You want, the, you want the clams to stay nice and plump, you see? You don't want little bits of rubber. Love All a right? clam. Love a plump clam. All right, look in there, you see? Just gonna open that up. Look at that, he's still doing it. All right, so. Come on then. Get a pack, get, this is, this is how it's so easy, mate. Look, there's no messing about. Look at all that lovely sauce. You've got the smoked bacon, the smoked pancetta. Okay, you've got the lovely wine, fresh sage. All right, look at that. And then a bit of sage that I saved earlier. On bang top. it on the top and give it to some hard working people. So we are guys, get stuck in Chaps this. and chapette. There's some bread. Fill your boots. It's finger food, just pick it up. And get in there. Grab a clam. A little bit off. All right, here's the clams. Yeah, grab it. You see, do you know what the downside of doing these videos is, Kyle? You can't eat anything. I can't bloody eat anything. Why are you lot are digging in? As it tastes good. Yeah, mate. Have that little, that's, now that's Richard's that's bread. Stuck in the sauce. Mm-hmm. Super easy. You've seen how we've done it. Really, really easy. And we've got everything from Rye. 
We're so, so lucky where we live. We've got all these beautiful ingredients. Now you can see where we've got it from and you can go and try and do it yourself. Mate, wow. I'm speechless for once. Chaps, what do you think? All Absolutely. good? Absolutely good. Absolutely. Mm. <laughs> we'll have to cook on our boat, definitely. Beautiful. Right, as a little footnote, here we are. That's what we've got left. Nothing. An Empty clams. I'll have that then if you don't want it. You get in there. <laughs> Go on, get in there. But I have to say, if you enjoy these little vids with uh, a little food trip, this man here, the legend Carl Tatner, it's always a pleasure, mate. I love it. It's been an this. absolute pleasure. And look, it's all been eaten. And you get wonderful gentlemen like this who've wandered down, eat your food. Still eating it. And he's still bloody it's eating right place, it. Right time. This is it. Um, but if you do enjoy these, we're going to start knocking a few more out and hopefully it'll encourage a few more of you to eat local produce and start cooking. <laughs>